Hello and welcome back. I'm Bebo Joe, and this is Workers and Resources Soviet Republic Season 3. We're on board of our little helicopter. We are heading straight to Strakarov, and you can see the little harbor a little bit there, peeking out of the of the fog, nebula, whatever you want to call it. There's a ship on the right that's bringing some more cement. Yes, we actually used, well, we deposited a lot of cement already. And yeah, our little area is starting to grow. We need more. We need more stuff before we can actually be really active over here. There's a couple things already done, but a lot more needs to get done. So that and more next. Okay, so let's start over here. Did we talk about everything that's going on here? I think so. I have a ship parked here with just materials. However, you cannot assign a construction office to a harbor. Um, but what you can do is assign um, all normal storages. So what I'm doing right now is wherever they are, I think they're trying to refuel right now. I have a bunch of flatbeds that just go between here and the storage and they are transporting whatever we need. So our construction office has the open storage assigned now. The problem, we don't have a warehouse. I, I, I was sure I was forgetting something. Now, normally I would try to squeeze something really small in here that we don't actually need, but in this case, where's the warehouse? Oh, here. In this case, I think a fully, a fully full-sized warehouse will be exactly what we need because I highly doubt that's the only, oh no, free excavators, they're all constructing, they're all building some roads right now. And we have some fuel problems because they're, the, the roads are impassable. I decided to upgrade these. But yeah, that's that's one of the things we need to do. We need to get um, a warehouse out here, and then we actually have to ship materials in. Which brings us to the next point. How are we going to get materials here? Well, they have to come from somewhere. The easiest way is out here, but I don't have a warehouse attached to this. And that's not going to happen. I'm not going to build a warehouse there. No. Um, why? Because I didn't think I need one. I thought I could just take it straight from um, the trains when they arrive there, but that's not a thing. That's not how that's gonna work. And instead, we just have to find a different harbor, cargo harbor that we can use that is appropriately sized, that does not necessarily need a train connection because all we need, well, I would like a train connection. <laughs> you know how I work. Doesn't need a train connection, b Joe. Who are you? Who, what did you do to uh, uh, b Joe? Um, no, what we're going to do is find a cargo harbor that, this is small, this is really, so you can go from one to three, um, harbor places, cool, <laughs> whatever, um, I'll make that work. I wish, really wish this was exactly where it was before, where you had it, like these landscaping tools were part of the construction material, uh, construction menu, wherever you were. And that made sense because whenever you couldn't do something, you could just act on it straight from there. Now that's no longer a thing. You have to click around a little more, but man, I will survive. Cool. Little harbor here. I hope those islands there don't interrupt everything that we need to do there. I think we're just gonna splice uh, a little train line here, maybe even a one way. Pull it out this way and then connect straight into there. That could work. That could totally work. I don't know if I want to do that, but I want to build more. I definitely want to build more all the time because I was not building enough for way too long and I was getting bored, which means I'm pretty sure you were getting bored. And that's probably also why my views were down. Um, not gonna lie. like. How often can you see a half episode where you're just setting up things and making sure things are actually playing along right? Only so many times before you're like, uh, I've seen this before. I, I, I think I've seen this before. People don't, I've seen this before. Stop doing the same thing over and over again. And you can also just tell me that, that's that's fine. I, I will try to hear you. Sometimes you don't want to hear exactly what people are thinking, but you do kind of want to hear what they're thinking because it's usually Important, correct, um, appropriate, pff, many things. It can be many things, but here we go. So we have that one in. What warehouse do we want? Do I want one of these? What is this? It's tiny. <laughs> I actually thought I was going to get a bigger warehouse, not a smaller warehouse, but there we are. That's not going to work. Um, regular warehouse? Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Is that big enough? 
waterfront small barn that's not gonna work this warehouse what's this that's what i just clicked on what's the other one um i feel like you two are the same pretty much nope regular warehouse stop st stop making it complicated now the thing with ships is one warehouse is just not gonna cut it <laughs> There is way too much uh, storage in one chip. So what I should probably do instead is redo my roads to allow myself for more than one warehouse to be connected here. I don't think I'm going to get four or five connected, but I think at least two in this area right here should be very possible. And then because, um, and I did this test, warehouses are actually... Um, about as efficient at unloading as um, the cargo stations, kind of. You, you know what test I'm talking about. You could directly unload into a cargo station and get a pretty good result, but you can also just um, use a cargo station. And I'm going to use a cargo station because we have two um, warehouses here at the same time. And we're going to flip them. Not quite the flip that I wanted. Or is it? No, it is. It's totally the flip that I wanted. <laughs> sweet thank you mirror this is awesome okay get you in here nope i want actually can we yes we can stop fighting me game <laughs> Gee. okay now we just throw a cargo station in here no we won't we have to lower this terrain first excuse me for probably five minutes or so you know what this may be good enough as long as I can get a little bit of piece of road out here, which I can't, <laughs> that's fine. And I did replace the terrible, terrible excavators that I had in this area with the good ones, with the actual ones that are usable. Hey, Snow, didn't expect you already. Um, we may play a little bit, of, you may see a little bit of YouTube magic where the snow just disappears by the time I uh, get back. Okay, we got rid of the snow. Uh, wonderful, now you can actually see what I'm trying to do here and that's important to me. Yes, it is. It's very important to me, actually. Um, can we... Honestly, road, um, you are not as important as rail. Sorry to tell you. Rail, rail, yes, concrete rail. That's what we want to start with, as usual. I am going to allow some um, crossing here. Just, yeah, and I want it, honestly, I think I want this just to be a one way. I could. There's so much room. There is so much room here. I could make this a almost a Y junction. It's not really a Y junction. Why? Why are you fighting me? Game. Stop it. All I want to do. Yes. Just like that. And then up here. You can't. Okay, how about I try this the other way first? None of that's working, okay. Um, okay, a little further back. Yes, that's what you wanted. Okay, that's good, that's good, why not? We'll just do that on that side and then do something very similar on this side. I will, I will try to make it look pretty, but honestly, F4 this so you can actually snap to it. This is not that important. It just has to work. Just has to work. Doesn't have to be pretty. We could put a tunnel in here. Um, we will put a tunnel in there because there's already enough of a of an incline um, that that makes enough sense. There you go. Sneaky little tunnel there. Connect this one in a way that makes enough sense. Thank you. Get this one. Sure. Why not? Um... For some reason I got lucky here. I didn't actually look at what I was doing, but this will work. Um, that is connected just fine. This can go in there. We have cargo. I think we are pretty much ready to go. Can we... What can we do here? Can we... <laughs> I want to cross this rail in some fashion. Thank you. No, you can't. You can't do this. This game. Today. Today... Just not the day to mess with me. Let's try this. Can you come over here? No, you can't. Can we make this a little lower? Okay, almost parallel to the road. That's fine. That works for me. Get that one in there. 
The only thing I have to check is how much fuel capacity, 100 tons of fuel. That feels like a pretty good amount that I don't need to add another extra tank there. So that should be fine. Let's get the rail um, set up. And this is actually a good turnaround point too, for real. That will be nice. I, what do I need? I need, uh, I took this crossing out earlier. I don't think I have a real choice here. I just have to put it back in. So let's put that one here. Ooh, ooh, no, 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 no. Why would I do that? I don't have to put it in there. I can just put it in right where I need it instead of where I want it or where I think I want it. That should be great. So just putting you going back a little bit, putting these two in here. One should already be assigned. The other one, eh, we'll be fine. Um, just if I remove all those signals, they can do it. Yeah, I'll, I'll figure that one out right now. <laughs> Stop, stop stalling. Just get this done. If you take all of these signals out, there will be no problem for any of the trains to do exactly what they're supposed to do. Um, this one, this one, and uh, I don't want to take this one out because it's a really long junction that will be blocked for a really long time. But honestly, that crossing should take no time at all to get done. So we'll just wait on that. They should both be assigned already. There's a train coming out. I'm assuming it's just going to stay in this orange block until it's done. That's fine. It'll only take a few seconds, and then we can set up the signals again. That guy's already doing its thing. Cool. That's fine. And we can do both of the opposite sides um, whenever they're done. Whenever they're ready. Where are you going? Yes, you're doing the correct side already. Sweet. Why do I need that one? I don't. <laughs> I'm an idiot. I am an idiot. I didn't need this side at all. A train can just go across here, in there, and then all he has to do is just go straight back. It doesn't need to do the other opposite side there at all. But we have done that. Um, I'll fix this. That should be better, and this will get constructed at some point, I hope, from number three. Um, number four is too far away. So yeah, that should work. Journey. Um, I did not actually place any vehicles in any of those buildings. Um, that's less than ideal. <laughs> that means I don't know the loyalty of a lot of people, which is probably why this number is not great. I will, I will catch that up right now, and I'll see you um, once the vehicles arrive. Okay, and while we were waiting for the cars, honestly, why, why lie to you? I did not buy, what was that, 80 cars at the border post. I just bought them directly into the, into the houses. It's not, it's cool, but... Once it becomes tedious, it's just not the right thing to do anymore. I don't think so. So um, all the secret polices now have vehicles and they can actually tell me what the loyalty is of all the residents besides one. That one is over here. Has a prime spot right by the, by the water, but well, it's not built yet. <laughs> and construction of us three is actually pretty busy right now because of what we built last time. At least it's progressing pretty nicely. Uh, let's see, this one, number three, assign everything that you can. Nice. And then number one, assign everything that you can on that side. I think number four can help on this side. Cool. Awesome. Things are progressing pretty nicely. Once this is done, we will produce eight tons of chemicals a day. <laughs> Which is, honestly, that's a pretty good number um, compared to everything else. So... That is a pretty... Why is this train so slow? That's a pretty good number. I'm pretty happy about that. I'm looking at all the numbers up here. That still looks fine. This 12% should change once I um, once this area completes. Yeah, what else do we need? I don't think I have any more... Gosh, these power lines are just overloaded everywhere. But this line is not used a lot. I'll just Oh, this is what I changed last time. I just added two switches, so I have one extra line connecting there. This one, once it gets connected, hopefully gives more power to this area in general. That would be nice. Um, but it's hard to say if that is actually going to happen until this is all done. Yeah, no, Do I, should I? Part of me says plan a new city here um, before Stakharov because Stakharov is currently, where are you? Yeah, I did put a road in here to get to the border post because I thought I needed to get cement in. But then when I figured out how to get cement there, um, I didn't need that anymore. 
I have a bunch of things assigned, so I'm getting this forklift garage done, because why not? It looks like we have the excavators back that I needed. So let's complete what we started at the beginning, first of all. Um, a warehouse. We will need one, otherwise we cannot um, get some of the materials that we need to construct anything. And that would be bad. What is this? F2. Yes. We gotta lower all of this. Gosh, so much terraforming. Love it and hate it and love it and hate it. And every time, same thing. You're just like, ah, oh, what have we done? There's a big empty spot over there. Can you guess what we're going to put there? I played with it for a little while in between episodes just to wait for things. See how they were progressing. And, um, well, I think it's going to be totally worth it. Gosh, it's going to take a while. Okay, there's the warehouse. That fits there well enough. Doesn't have to be doesn't have to be amazing now can i just get this one in there yes i can i saw it um no <laughs> out of all locations that you could have gone there that's not the one i will allow all i want you to do is to connect here there you go that's all i wanted and then we will need to tell our helicopters to construct this piece because there's no way to access this or this piece for vehicles without helicopters um it's sad but it's the way it is it's been a bug for many updates so far and they're aware of it um it's just not now with the helicopters it's not really game breaking anymore at least i would agree, i would argue it isn't um so yeah there there you go um sure get you out of there get you here take that one away assign the road assign the road road is number two there you go assign that looks a little hideous um it'll be fine trust me it's it's totally fine so this one is done the next thing, I would like to plant power over here. I would like to build this area, but um, we're currently still produce or using gravel to get a bunch of roads done, which honestly, we're getting pretty close. This area may stay dirt for a longer period of time. I don't know if I'm ever going to change it, um, just because it's more important. Everything else looks like it's ready now. So yeah, let's plan out our nuclear power plant in Grigoriodida. Grigoriodida. That doesn't that sounds more Spanish than Russian, but probably wrong. Probably means something that I'm not aware of, and you're gonna hopefully tell me what that is. That'd be great. Nuclear power plant. Go big or go home. Um, flip that so the entry is on the other side. Get you as far into the mountain as possible. Yes, I I pre flip you again. Ah, uh, your mirror is wrong. <laughs> Actually, no, this is fine. Uh, this is where I wanted you, I think. I want that um, road connection a little bit off from where the mountain is, just so that I can actually connect to it. Um, we're not going to use a bus station or anything for this one. This is just going to be um, a direct connection from wherever we have people and workers at. Right now, that is in uh, Part of Beast, but Part of Beast is set up to not allow um, workers to come in yet. Which we all know why. This one, I believe, is the only way I can connect this. Played with that a little bit before. And then I wanted, I was hoping I could find a space up here somewhere. Just a little further away from the, um, from the nuclear plant. But close enough that it makes sense that it's part of it. That looks good to me. Ah, uh, it's doing the wrong thing. I'll be fine. We can go over under. <laughs> Let's see how under can we go? Not huh? I will allow that. That one time I'll allow it. You can go there, you can go around yourself. Yes. A little more. This obviously looks a lot better. Now, if you never play with nuclear stuff, you cannot chain these together. Only one per uh, per side. One one of the cooling tower pipes. Is what I'm talking about. Um, we're right by the water, which feels like it's the right place for a nuclear power plant. I know they use a lot of water in their cooling tower, so there you go. This is the... <laughs> I like this space for it. <laughs> Don't try to find super anythings when you talk, people do. It's just... It's just a location. It's fine. You you did good. This is this is a very reasonable location for what you're doing here. 
Um, just leave it at that, as that, and stop talking about it. Okay, I will. Yeah, thank you. Cool. Let's see if this road can connect to something. Uh, it can. Awesome. Get you right out here, and then get you. Looks good. This looks even better. Have a direct line connected here. And then while we're here, why don't we just upgrade you? Everything else is already gravel. Cool. So, nuclear power plant. Connect it. Obviously, there's 800 uh, power lines that we have to connect to. I actually think we should make a battery of under underwater um, pipes and connect them and then um, use whatever the equivalent the high voltage the big high voltage lines to connect to our existing grid on the other side and just have like two two of the power line or maybe just one we only have one city here without industries really um, connect to wherever this power line already is so we have enough power for this thing to exist i think that will be fine um how's it going here uh, I would say it's gone pretty all right. Let's get this one assigned and built. I think number two, we need your help for this warehouse. Otherwise, it's never going to get done because materials. Um, roads, please get those assigned. They're not going to happen for a while until this one is built. And that one's not going to get built for quite some time. What does this one need? Mechanical components. So some of these pieces are still too close together for helicopters to get in, so we can't actually do anything there. That's fine. That's all right. Where are you trying to go? You are trying to go to helicopter construction office. Um, what is your problem? Oh, there's a little piece of road that requires workers. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, number five, assign you there, get the workers to the fire station so that guy can deliver its fuel. And honestly, we have a bus here. Um, I want you to go there, pick up your people there from the heliport, because I set up the heliport to be a transfer station now. There's a bus, it's finally moving, cool. Yeah, get a couple things done here. Once the warehouse is done, we can start constructing more and thinking about more things for right now. Roads, tunnels, um, general infrastructure. I should just get this one signed. Number five, you as well. Cool. Once all of that is done, we should be able to do more. How's this? You're too small. <laughs> I have too many pieces that are too small um, that require... that cannot use mechanisms that require people and we don't have that many people available here i can probably throw another helicopter onto this route that may be the smart thing to do um let's just get this one like that you come out here let's go to our airport right there by another helicopter about the same size helicopter mi10 is 28 mi6 is 47 cool Get you a. I can't assign you like that. Lame. <laughs> really hoping I could. Okay. Get you going. Start. Thank you. It looks like we cannot set up line spacing on helicopters. Whatever. That's fine. How's this going? We're full on food, full on clothes, full of electronics. No alcohol yet. I don't believe I'm actually delivering any alcohol here, so I should set that up really quick. Train is waiting too long. I don't like to see that on this type of train. Where are you waiting? Oh, construction area. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, you are waiting. Why are you waiting? Because you cannot go back. Uh, you go home for right now and don't work on this construction side from that side. That's really all we need. As long as I can just go on the left here, eventually that will end up here and that should be fine. Um, cool, 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 cool. Big container ship is almost done. That is the next thing that I should build. No, I shouldn't. No, I shouldn't. What do I have here, time-wise? I'm at about 30 minutes. I'm, I'm kind of aimlessly flying around right now, but it's not really aimless because I want to see how we're doing here. Better than expected. That's nice. Um, number three. Okay, I don't need you to go that side. Stay on this side and construct everything you can. There's just not a lot you can construct. It's not helpful. Um, but it's fine. It's fine. We'll, we'll figure it out. What I would like to do is set up electronics next. 
and looking at the landscape, there's a little bit of room up here that I could put some electronics or I could have put them down here. But if I put them down here, I essentially have to use Beluga as the um, source of workers, which honestly, I don't think... Um, I don't think we're going to have enough workers here. How, how is our electronics going? Last time we had 8,000, now we're 13,000. Loyalty is probably going up. Pretty certain about that. Unemployment over here, how's that going? Workers, unemployed, let's see. It's still just just the right amount for what we need for this group of buildings. Where where else do we have unemployed workers? Um, this No, no, actually putting those two cities together Bringing them up here will be probably enough to have a number of to have the electronics produced up here as well. So let's do that. Advanced industries. Electrical components need electronic components, and electronics assembly hall needs electronics, some plastics, and other things. What am I producing here? Chemicals. <laughs> I forgot a step. Okay, no problem. We want plastics. Plastic wants three chemicals and 27 tons of oil. I know where you're going. You're just going down here. You're, you're small and all, but since you have a higher volume of oil that I need, that I require, I don't want you that far away. What's your pollution? Uh, pollution per year, 13.4. I think that just means we put you here. Your output per day is 6.6 .6 tons of plastic. We could easily use this warehouse to store plastic. I think we can start with that so we don't accidentally overfill it with more food. 65%, 81 tons of food. That is a good number to me. We can also use the warehouse over here. And friendships also could store some. So why not? Yeah, let's set up over here. We don't have to have trains for everything simply because there's not really a good um, room for it. But how many, how many chemicals are we producing now? Eight tons a day. So let's set up two of these. Yeah, it, it's not not the big um, thing that you used to from me, but I think it will be just fine. So we can mirror them. We, we know that now. Put one here. Cool. Uh, mirror that one. Pull you apart just a little bit. Set you up here. Cool. Um, that was stupid. <laughs> Let's redo that. Why was that stupid? because you can just throw a warehouse in between for the plastics and for um, the chemicals. So we don't have to, oh, this is, this is annoying. So we don't have to get any transport for them. They can just be transferred right away. And since we only have two, uh, two buildings here, I don't think it's worth setting up another forklift factory connection thingamajig. So let's just get this one nice and smooth-ish. I should probably just use a bigger flattener, but nah, let's just do this. This is nice, this is nice. Put you somewhat in the middle, but to the front, because I already know that it's gonna be a little hard um, to put the, what else did you need? You need oils and chemicals. No, this should be fine because oil can be underground. So put you here. Here I said, thank you. Rotate, no, rotate is wrong. R is not what we wanted, we want mirror. Okay, right here. That looks good. Um, road connection, maybe? I mean, sure. If you insist that that is how you want to do this, that's, that's fine, I guess. Um... I'm gonna say the actual bus stop will be somewhere south of where I'm at right now. As long as you connect. Yes, that's good. I think the bus stop should be right in this area. So let's do that. Regular bus stop should be more than sufficient. And if this is not sufficient, just add um, asphalt roads instead of concrete roads. Yeah, we'll probably make this asphalt anyways. That can get assigned. Cool. Um, let's get number three assigned to the roads so they can get that one going. And then we need some piping. Um, mm -hmm -hmm. 
I'm in between a little bit of... Should I just suck it out directly? I don't have a pipe connection that's currently open. Well, I have a couple um, storage units that are open that I could use. Um, you know what? Why not? Use the last one here. It doesn't have to be full all the time, but it should be full now with the setup that we have. So, yeah. We're just going to take it out from here. F3. Let's see how far we can go. Too long. Okay. Make the first one here. Make you an above ground pipe. Pump. Pipe pump. Fuel pump. Oil pump. Yes, that's the word. <laughs> you got it. Um, get that one in there. Get the pipes connected up here. Very good. And then run an underground piping thing. Um, right here, I guess. That looks good. Get this one connected, hopefully. Too long again. Okay. In that case, you will just go over here. I don't need to add more engines there unless they're absolutely necessary. Um, I do want you... No, I don't need you to be underground. You can be this one. Which then brings me to the point why even use underground pipes if you're just going to do this. You're right. Let's not do that. Let's use the above ground pipes because we have above ground piping. Um, well, I say that. <laughs> this one can be underground. Cool. The next piece can be above ground. Yes. Up twice, over here, and there, and then this piece can... No, th this, this is actually two. Um, we'll just do this. One runs straight into there. One underground. See how ugly is this? Fine. Runs right into there. Get that one assigned. Take away this um, view. What I was trying to say. Get you connected there. I just didn't want to split up that road. Um, unless it's absolutely necessary. And now we get plastics. <laughs> well, I hope we will. How many people do we need in there? we will probably check that. Fossil fuels. Plastics. Another 360 workers. You know what? This will turn into a small hub. We're going to have um, trains bringing in passengers from the other um, municipalities. Is that the word? <laughs> I think so. And we can also expand the city here a little bit. Maybe I'll do that as well. But this all has to be built. There's a lot to be built right now, um, which honestly I am pretty excited about because it's much better than not building. I'll tell you that for nothing. Um, but there's just a lot and lot and lot to do. Uh, we, we need this harbor to kind of be done. Um, and I know three is overloaded right now. So let's give four some stuff to work on. When I say those numbers, I hope you realize that's just my action groups that I have uh, for the construction offices. Nothing else. Uh, it's just how I talk to them. Now, here. I think one thing we can still do for today is fix our um, tourist lines. Where's our tourist train? You're not tourist. You're one of the bigger ones. You are, I think, a tourist. Canada large. Yes. Um, you, when you make it to this station. Volkadene train platform. Volkadene train platform. Yeah, just let them transfer, please. Thank you. That should be good enough for that. Then we should have... Oh, we only have one. Nice. Um, you are... What are you? You are Volkadene bus platform small. Okay. Um... On the way out, we're going to have a platform small. Really don't like that they got rid of the um, the numbers, but I will survive. Actually, after the first one, I want you to go here and load only. Don't have to unload anyone. Cool. And then on the way back, we're going to have a bus platform small. This one on the way back. You can, after the bus platform, you can stop again here, and then you can unload um, with transfer. It's for it's for all workers. It's not just for well, sorry, it's for all passengers. It's not just for the um, 
What am I saying? For the tourists, but it's also for the tourists. So tourists, you should not go anywhere anymore, actually. That's that's my preferred thing uh, from here. So whoever drops you off there, you just go to wherever you want to go. That's fine. Um, this one should no longer need to assign anything. Uh, you go away. Th this might break everything. Uh, I'm not going to lie. You don't have to go there. That should be good. This one... Workers are fine. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. This was part of a circle um, action that we don't need anymore. And this one is also good. Because what I want to do now is set up... Honestly, instead of this platform or this station, I'd probably rather have them go here and make it a transfer. Could be good. Yeah, I think that's the right one. So instead of bus platform small, you come out here. So you pass there. Instead of going there, I want you to go here. Um, make that a transfer. Unload and load, that's fine. Whoever you unload there, do this. Um, nope, that's the wrong one. <laughs> look at the right thing when you're looking at things. Okay. Giveaway station, that sounds good. This one we don't need anymore. Okay, I did it on the wrong one. <laughs> I did it on the bus instead of the whole line. This one's a special one. Where are you going? You're just going straight to there. Very interesting. Look at me, train platform. Definitely do this. Um, yeah, that's good. Um, where's the other buses? This one. Yeah, you're the long line. I said after the bus platform small i would like you to go here and make an exchange and then before the bus platform small do the same thing okay this should help a lot because now there's two things that i can do is this yeah this is one of the trains that i want what are you on you're on the last last station perfect i want you after this to go to here, do your thing. Uh, you don't have to do, uh, should you do this a station? No, this one is not a transfer because I need to actually get them to go to the airport directly. And after the airport, I want you to go back to here and drop off people as a transfer again. Cool, that should work. Um, which also means we can set up our first airplane. Mm. I see. Ah, <laughs> uh, do you see what I didn't do? I see what I didn't do. I totally... Oh, there's actually two things I still need here. I need workers. Which, that, that train may bring some workers out here, but it may not be enough. Are there workers waiting here? Yes, there are some workers waiting there. Um... I don't want to put a tram here, because a tram is just way too slow. Um, uh, but I have multiple problems. I cannot buy airplanes on this setup. I need to add another... I forgot that. I, I kind of had a feeling that was a thing, but I wasn't 100% certain. Now I am. I just need to build one more... Oh, God. I need one... Um, hangar place thingy where I can actually buy any any planes that I need. Um, otherwise, I can't do anything. So, let's lower this terrain a little bit while we're here. Cool, cool, cool. Just enough so I can buy. <laughs> so I can build that thing out. Once, and in the meantime, while that thing is building, I can probably set up some... Um, some worker transport. There we go. That's the spirit. Now I got it. Um, get you in here. Cool. Sign you. Yep. Nine, four. Build that one. Thank you. Um, we got that one. Now, how do we get workers here? This is a normal station, but tourists, I want to go here. And tourists, I want to go here. So they can go back and forth. That should be self-explanatory. We should have fuel here now. Won't go in here without a pump now, will it? Mm. Maybe they still suck it out. 
the airplanes. We, uh, that, that'll be pretty easy to find out if we, if I made a boo-boo there or not. Um, I think one of the things I can do is use the large, um, go all over the place train tour. I think that's this one. Yes. Um, show me your line. What is a stop? One of the stops is here, and that's on the way to where I want to go. And the name of this guy is... We'll just look here. <laughs> After this one, Friendship's Bus Stop. Um, Journey. Where is this? That one, okay. Um, oh, you're going back here. And Friendship's Train Platform. Volca Danelli. That's out here. I think after this one, I want you to go also to the airport. Yes. Yes, go to the airport. But here, I would like you to make a transfer, whoever you drop off there. Um, Straparni, no, no. Journey train, for, yep. Make a transfer here. You don't have to drop them off. Yes, I, I think this is something I'm going to use a lot more down the road. Right now, it's obviously just retrofitting it, making sure it kind of works with what we have going here. Um, but I think it will be a very big part of what we want to do. Looks like you should be working. You are just bringing two dumpers in. <laughs> Where are you? There's one dumper driving uh, 50. I think there's some snow still somewhere laying around and that's why things are slow when i skipped forward earlier through the snow it was just i essentially just added days but it's not going to reload until i turn on and off seasons and i don't want to do that right now population wise i'm kind of surprised to not see a lot more than what's going on there but yeah no things are going a lot slower right now because i was impatient earlier snow is not as bad but at least we can have everyone help here. Um, yeah. I think that's good. Um, are we done with our warehouse out here? We are indeed. We are not done with the new terminal over here, but we are about to get started on that, and that is nice. That counts for something. Um, Rail-wise, we did a little bit of work. That's fine. Eventually we'll get this done. Not that worried about it. Actually, I can just replace the signals here and make this right. So that you don't block everyone. This looks good. Get a mixed signal in here. And in here. There you go. And now this tunnel can actually get completed. Cool. Yeah. No, lots of stuff going on. Lots of stuff that needs to be completed. Uh, chemicals and, you know. Nice. Oh, the pipes are already done. Sweet. Chemicals and plastics are a couple things that we're getting. And once we have those, we should be able to make our own electronics and electronic components. I've held on not doing those for long enough, I think. So it's about time that we get there. Could add a road there. No, no, no. Leave it alone. Leave it all alone. Um, this will get built eventually. Right now the roads are just slow, but that's fine. It's not going to stop me. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. Really appreciate it. And I would appreciate a like, subscribe, other things, suggestions on what you want me to do. But I think this is the pace we're going to we're gonna keep going right now. There's a lot going on everywhere. And Strakarov is going to happen 100%, especially now with the transfers. I just want to get at least enough of the construction, everything um, ready so we can actually do something more effectively. How are we doing here? You're fine. You're fine. We don't need five people in here. Who, who set this up? Who did this? Um, just two and two. No workers. I don't know why there are no... Oh, no workers because you can't get to it. <laughs> oh, great. And this one, hopefully... Oh, good. Helicopters can actually get to it. I was worried. Yeah, there's a lot more to do. We still have to finish our little gulags over here um, and actually have some workers living in this area. It's a little weird. You don't have 21-year-olds living with their parents anymore because of how they can relocate all the time. But I have less uh, people living here than normal. 
I think one of the things that they did was uh, reset just everything um, after the update for, for people. So some of them were just grumpy um, by default. And that didn't work. Did I fix this? Yeah, this is working. Oh, so much to do. Let's hop on a train. See where he goes. I have no idea where he's going. Somewhere. I may go to the airport. Cool. Um, thanks for watching this long. Um, I'll see you again next time. Bye.